Why your top lip bigger than your bottom lip? Yo guys, what is up? It's Connor, and today I'm gonna be... I'm just gonna get right into the video, basically. So, as some of you know, this kid named Ricky made a video about how I attacked him because he DM'd my girlfriend, and basically he just blew it out of proportion, and he used her name, and then I think he put my name in when we made our channel because, you know, Carly and Connor, our channel's doing really well. I mean, it's gonna catch him, pass him in a month or two, so I think I think he just wanted to use our names to get some views, and it worked. He's at, like, 48,000 views. Whatever. But today I'm gonna react to his video and talk about what happened and just... It's not worthy of a YouTube video. I mean, he just made the video because he knew Carly was popular on YouTube, and he knew he'd get views, so he had to do it. He had to just... Let's just, let's just get started. But like, do you ever just get bored of social media, right? And you're just scrolling down and I get bored you're just, just, just really bored. And yeah. that what happened to me. So one day I was just scrolling down my Twitter timeline and I saw this girl. I saw a picture of this girl. Can we just like take a moment to recognize his facial expressions throughout this video? He's like, I'm just bored. I just get scroll down on social media. Just, just watch it. And um, I was like, oh, this is cool. I didn't even know who she was. Clicked on her profile. She was just some famous girl. I was like, okay, whatever. I'm just going to send her a DM. And I'm just going to say some stupid stuff. And she'll s never see the DM. And yeah, whatever. So he's a fanboy, basically. Because he saw that she had followers. And he, he, he knew she wasn't going to see the DM. So he, I mean, he just wanted to DM her. He's a little fanboy. Whatever. I just, I just like to DM like famous people and just like message them stupid stuff because I know they're never gonna see the message. So I'm just like, whatever. Let me just say something stupid. And say so yeah, stupid. basically, yeah, I just say something stupid. What would saying something stupid be? Like, hey, my name is Ricky and I'm a famous YouTuber. Which well, that's stupid because you're not. This girl, um, just like a weird DM. And basically, in the DM, all I said, this is what I said. <laughs> I said, just date me, right? And so yeah, I just said, just I, I don't think that's stupid. That's like telling somebody to date you. That's starting a relationship right there. If you're saying just date me, you're just saying, just date me already. Like, please, just date me. <laughs> I said, just date me. I was just super bored, whatever. It was just some cute girl on Twitter. Message her. I had no idea who she was. Keyword there, cute girl. You message her because she's cute, boy. That's my baby. Who she, she was. was. And this person, it was a girl, her name was Carly Steele. He had to emphasize that. He had to, Carly Steele. He had to do that, you know, because that, she's the main part of the video. I mean, that's why there's the 50,000 views, I mean. And, <laughs> yeah, um, so I'm just that's chilling so funny, bro. later on, and I just, just out of nowhere, I get a freaking DM. And it was from this guy named Connor Bo Bay. And I, I don't know if you're serious about telling Carly to date you, LMAO, but I'm her boyfriend, Laffy Faze Heart. <laughs> Much love, just letting you know, my guy. I was really nice about it. I was like, yo, you told my girlfriend to just date you. I'm her boyfriend, just letting you know that she's not single. That's all. I was being a nice person, you know. I wasn't rude. I wasn't like, yo, dude, don't DM my girl. We're going to have problems, you know. I was, I was nice about it. So then I'm like, oh, look, fudge, look, fudge. Um, I Did you really have to do that? Did you really have to? What, what the fudge? What the fudge? Um, I was just, I was like, what the, f how did that happen? Um, and apparently, Connor was Carly's boyfriend and, um, you know, Carly, oh, he was pissed. At this moment, he's like, dang it, she's taken. Carly, apparently, she saw the DM and she was like, I gotta tell my boyfriend right away. And I was like, I don't even know why she would do that because I was irrelevant at the time. I'm still Bruh. kind of irrelevant. Bruh. But yeah, so basically nobody even knew him. You are still irrelevant, but that has nothing to do with it. I mean, if the guy says date me and somebody's hitting on her, she's still gonna have to, you know, she's gonna tell me. That's like, what? just cause you're irrelevant doesn't mean anything. Uh, like, what? About me at that time and um, yeah. And I was just like, okay, th that is the weirdest thing ever, but all right, that's cool. Like, I kind of freaked out because I was like, dang, he has hella followers and he's verified. So I was like, that's pretty dopey. 
And but then I said, whoa, I didn't even know. I just randomly DM'd her and I wasn't serious. And don't beat me up. Um, you hear that? He said, don't beat me up. He was he just laughed when he said that. Like, this is the first time. I was nice and he said, don't beat me up. So, just keep watching. And I said, I seriously didn't even know she would see that. I'm pretty irrelevant at the moment. So, yeah, basically, He's I was just irrelevant. like, you know, what the fudge? What the um, and he said, hi, you're good, right? homie. Keep grinding. Um, I said, thanks, man. You might see me up with the big people soon. So, yeah, I was like, dang, this is so cool. I'm cool with this other guy. And um, I was like, okay, whatever. You know what I mean? Fast forward, I don't even know, like two months later. Um, and this was on freaking New Year's Eve. I have this auto DM feature. There's this app called Crowdfire. And basically, I know if you use Twitter. So this is two months later, and the message goes to my girlfriend's low-key Twitter. It's not her main Twitter anymore. It's her low-key Twitter. And he was already, I think he already followed her. And then he unfollowed her and then followed her again. So his DM, she had already been following him. So it didn't make sense that the DM automatically was sending. So I didn't really understand that. She followed him, I guess, before. I don't know. Hey, what's up? I love you, cutie baby girl. Ha <laughs> ha. Turn on notifications. I love you so much. Please follow. Love you. Um, whatever. So basically, they say stuff like that. And I had an auto DM that said, Hi, please love me. So I had a weird DM because I always saw those notifications. Please, I'll eat your ass. Um, DMs, so I kind of wanted to be different, so I said, hi, please love me, right? And sometimes it has that via at Crowdfire, and sometimes it doesn't. I was following Carly's low-key, and she was following me, and she actually followed me back after the whole incident and stuff, because, yeah, but yeah. Shut up. So, I, I don't know, out of nowhere, she was following me for a long time, and then out of nowhere, it sent an auto DM to her and said, hi, please love me, without the at via Crowdfire. That doesn't make sense to me how it, like, if they've been following each other for a long time or whatever, why would you send out? So that's why I was like, oh, that's not an automatic DM. I didn't even know he had the feature. And I didn't even know because you can't control the auto DMs, right? You, you can't even control it. And I'm just chilling, minding my own business. And this is what I see. <clears throat> Hey, pussy, I want you to do me a huge fucking favor and leave my girlfriend alone. I've already gotten your dumb ass out of this once, and you damn her low-key? I think she won't tell me? She don't want your ass and will never, so stop trying. I hope I catch your dumb ass at Payless for VidCon, you pussy-ass bitch. Uh, Whack-ass boy. And then I'm like, what the f Where did that just come from? And uh, I sent him a screenshot just to auto DM. And then he comes out of nowhere. She's followed you for a long time. Don't play stupid. And I just said, what's wrong with this guy? It's an R-O-E-M. Are you retarded? And I Did he just say, are you retarded? That's disrespectful. You don't use that language, dude. You should be ashamed of yourself. You know, you you, you just played yourself. You, you played yourself, boy. Like, DJ Khaled, <coughs> he said, I didn't play myself. Because you're still a both. The auto strike messed me up. I don't know what a both is, but I said question mark. It was an auto DM, bro. And he says, and if you want to have this attitude, you can react to a video of us throwing hands. Thank you, good night. And then proceeds to block me. I did block him. Honestly, I was just, I was, I was trying to be polite. Like, Nobody wants your girlfriend, but he said, please date me. <laughs> what? No correlation. No correlation. But even though I'm not Conor McGregor, you know, I'll still throw the hands with you. He said the R word two times. I think that's very disrespectful from my standpoint. I don't say the word because it's disrespectful to people that are actually mentally disabled. So don't use that word, Ricky, okay? This dude's so weird. Okay, that's basically the video, but I did some research. I dug deep. I went through his old videos. I found some, some stuff, you know, I mean, and it's just, you guys have to see this. Just watch this video and try not to cringe. Hey, what's up, guys? It is Ricky here, and I am back today with a new video. Um, 
-hmm. But yeah, uh, <laughs> today we're going to be doing a reaction video to Lisa and Lena talking. Lisa. There yeah, there's a video of that. Um, it's really short. Sorry for the really short video today. Yeah, I'm also wearing the same thing as yesterday because this is the same recording session. This is literally... So yeah. What? What is this? What are you Alright, um... Why is he yeah, talking like that? Just watch this. Three million times soon. What the so frick? <laughs> what the frick? I'm like so leave. We love you. <laughs> okay, so That's that it. was literally... The most adorable He's thing like, ever. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my gosh. Um. So like. I can't. I can't. Uh, yeah, like these things are turned Oh my god, that was so. Oh my god. Oh what my is god. He doing? So yeah, guys, that was really adorable. Um. Yeah. Um. If you guys enjoyed, please leave a like and a comment. See you guys tomorrow. Bye. Why? Why? I'm sorry, I just couldn't. I was laughing for so long when I first watched this video, and I'm like, I have to show people because. But look, the video he made about me, look at the tags he used. <laughs> They're literally all people's names that have nothing to do with the video. I mean, take a look. He has to use other people's name for the views? Come on now, Ricky! And I went on my girlfriend's Instagram, and this was like yesterday or two days ago. And on the picture she posted with me and her, I was like hugging her, kissing her cheek. He comments, hi, please love me, trying to be all smart. And I'm like, okay, I know he's just joking this time, but like, you can't do that, bro. Like, you need to quit trying to get the reaction you want. I know you want to date her, but it's just not gonna happen. So then I was on his Instagram, and I was like, let's take a look at what he looks like. I've never really seen what he looks like besides this video. Boy, boy, why your top lip bigger than your bottom lip? I don't get it. His lip was a normal-ish size. I mean, it's still a little big. But what did you do to your lip to get at this? Did you get lip injections? In all of his selfies, I don't understand it. He puts one of his arms behind his back. Like, if you can see, you can't see his arm. Like, it's gone. Like, it fell off. It's just not there. Look, this one too. You can see a little part of his arm. He's like, I don't know if it's like supposed to get your jaw popping or what it's for, but why? Why do you do that? Another one. On behind the back. My name's Wiki. So yeah, that's basically it. A uh, guy with a big top lip and weird old videos, really awkward. He just decided to make a video about me and my girlfriend. Um, he had to use her name. It wasn't even about her. It was about basically me. He had to put her name in the title for the views, you know. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Be sure to like and subscribe. Come back for another video another time if you're new. But yeah, comment below what you guys think and peace out.